cuties! So I wanted to review Arena Tanamura's latest work, Idle Dreams. And Idle Dreams is about a 31-year-old woman named Shikha. She's on the cover. And she basically doesn't feel feminine anymore. She just works in an office and she feels like she's always one-upped by her younger, prettier co-workers. And she just feels kind of depressed. And she gets invited to her high school reunion. And there she sees her high school crush, Haru. Yes, it made me think of Haru from Free. But she sees him and he's just as handsome as ever. And then one of her friends from high school like runs up to her and starts talking to her. And then her friend from high school yells, what? You're still a virgin? And it and everyone hears and Haru laughs at her. And Shikaj like feels so embarrassed that she just like runs away from the class reunion. And she like is so depressed, she's like suicidal. Well, one of the people at the class reunion was also her high school friend and named Tokita. And he says, would you like to change your life? Don't kill yourself. We have an experimental drug that can turn you young again. And she really wants to like go back to being feminine and cute and bubbly as she was in high school. So she agrees to it because she's like, I have nothing else to lose. So she takes the pill and it turns her back into a high school girl. And she like leaves Takita's apartment. She says, thank you. And then she like runs off and she gets mistaken by some talent model agency people. And they think that she's like this pop star. And so they take her and they take her to like this photo shoot where she meets Hibiki, who is this like idol star. And he's just like really kind of rude to her, telling her she's ugly and everything. But you know, he actually turns out to be really cute. So yeah, basically the story is a 17 again type story and you have, she, Arena laid it out that you have two love interests. So there's Tokita who gave her the love potion and then there's Hibiki who is the young 15 year old pop star guy. So I'll explain Takita real fast. So Takita had a crush on her and he was never able to confess to her, but he was actually in love with her and it's actually really kind of like, Heart, like, oh, because after Takita gives Chikaj the pill, she leaves, and Takita actually currently has a girlfriend, and he calls his girlfriend, and she's like, are you still on for tomorrow night evening for dinner? And he's like, yeah, and she's like, did you see your first love again? And he's like, what are you talking about? You're my first love. And then he hangs up with her, and he goes, yes, I saw her, and she was enchanting, and I'm just like, oh my gosh. And then Hibiki, oh my gosh. So Hibiki, the pop star, is like, the typical Arena Tanamura main guy. He's, he reminds me a lot of Chiaki from Kamikaze Kaitajin, and I love Chiaki so much. So he basically, when he meets her, he's like really rude to her and everything, but I think he thinks he's, she's cute. And during the photo shoot, he kind of tricks her and kisses her, and like that's her first kiss. So the way Arena has it set up, like normally the guy that steals her first kiss and is like, Hibiki, because like he'll, he, another thing that reminds me of Chiaki is when he touches Chikaj, she gets nervous and like falls over, and that reminds me of Chiaki with Maron when she like twisted her ankle, and every time he would touch Chiaki would touch her ankle, she would like faint. So there are a lot of parallels; they're really alike. So, but the way Arena has it set up is because this manga is for older women like me in like their twenties, mid to late twenties or you know early 20s but it's basically for women in their 20s that she, she has it not like a typical shoujo so I don't know if she's going to get her to uh, Chikaz together with the high school or with the 15 year old pop star like she has it like she had the first chapter or two chapters or whatever like uh Chikaz is going to get together with Hibiki but then as I'm reading the other two and three manga like you think she's going to get together with Tokita and like I like Tokita but I feel like if he didn't make his move back when they were in high school and he already has a girlfriend I don't really think it's right for him to break up with his girlfriend just to be with Chikaj that he met again like I don't know I don't like that and I really actually like Hibiki because he's actually really precocious for his age and he you know he's just really mature and he just has dreams and he's always like encouraging Chikash. So yeah, I'm obviously going to go with the Vicky too because he has dark hair and he's adorable. But yeah, so I, I really don't want her to get together with Tokita and I'll be really depressed if they do. But the way she has it set up is like, she actually likes Tokita. I don't know. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm not going to give too many details away, but so the first book is like those two are the two main love interests. And then the second book really focuses on Tokita. And then all of a sudden they bring back, she brings back Haru and then this total other guy. So I don't know what Arena is doing, okay? Like, ah. Uh.
I don't know what she's doing with this manga. I don't know who she's going to get to get who Takaji's going to get together with. It is driving me up the wall. And another thing she had, Arena has in the notes, like if you read the notes in the back of the manga, she says her editor told her it couldn't be a typical Arena manga because the pages aren't as flowerly, flowerly. I can't talk. It doesn't have as many like flowers and it's not as detailed and like bubbles and you know stars. It's really simplistic because they said it's for an older audience, which I like the over the top beautiful flowers and everything but yeah so it's really simplistic so I don't know where Arena's going with this I don't know if it's gonna be a typical arena where she gets together with the Chiaki type character because she thinks the Chiaki type character is that way because he's younger and you know Takita is older so he's more mature but I don't want her to get together with Takita I want her to get together with Hideki I love him so yeah uh, I, I, I definitely recommend it it's really good I love the characters but I'm just going to cry if she doesn't get together with Hibiki because Hibiki. <laughs> so, yeah, let me know if you guys have read this. And if you like Arena Tenemar, I mean, who doesn't? She's amazing. But, yeah, let me know if you like her. And, yeah, I hope you guys like this little review. I tried not to spoil anything. I tried to keep it as simplistic as I could. Let me know if you like these types of videos. And I will talk to y'all later. Oh, and if you haven't subscribed to this YouTube channel, you'd like to subscribe. I post at least two to three times a week with cute, quiet anime and all that stuff. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, it is Make Loves Cute. And my Twitter is Make Loves Cute. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching and I'll talk to y'all later. Have a sweet day. Bye!